Okay, I almost made a mistake here by not taking that front cover off. The legs were interfering with trying to get the thing out. It was screwed right up there. So you got to loosen the legs so that you can lower the whole unit. And then as you pull it out, be careful that you don't snap the leg on the bottom. See that one in the center right there? And then just to come out close. I just about broke that one off. So now I've screwed it all the way up. Got the trap off now and it's finally stopped dripping for a second because I turned the outside hose tap on and that was what was causing it to drip. So I'm going to get in there and quickly change that isolating valve before it starts again. But you see, pull it out and then I can get in there to change the tap. And then because I didn't put sealant underneath there, all that is deteriorated um, countertop underneath. So I'm going to put uh, wood hardener underneath there. And maybe something else, but to start with that.